welcome back to my channel. So if you're wondering what's happening at the minute, the way I've got the kids from the bed, I am doing a compact with me, as you can see by the title below. Um, I am going to be going to London tomorrow with my nana. It's my nana's 75th birthday and she's never been to London, ever. So I'm taking her to go and say we will rock you. But I will be videoing that tomorrow and Sunday because we're only there for a night. So hence why I don't need a lot of stuff. So basically I just need toiletries, pyjamas and a change of clothes to go to come home in but with the weather being the way it is at the minute I don't know what to take so I'll probably take two pairs of pants and whatever but at the minute if you're wondering why I was being a bit weird I do have teeth whitening strips on at the minute um, and also I have got my travel outfit already sorted so that's all done but let's pack okay so the pair of pyjamas I am taking is these pyjamas here um, they are silk pyjamas, they are from Wolf and Whistle and um, I did already put these on the vlog when I packed for Greece have worn them since then so they're going to go in the bag I think the size is between a 12 or a 14 just with them being a silk they need to go a size because obviously if you put them in the wash they're going to shrink um, also as well I'm not changing any makeup because I'm going to be doing my makeup here because I don't want to be clotting that all the way around london so do that in the morning and then just take makeup cleansers and creams to take it off on the night time and then come back on the sunday with nothing on do you know what it is since i've got older i can't be bothered to put makeup on okay so i've just got a few bits out from the wardrobe um so i'm gonna start with these jeans that i got from the charity shop um this week i think i, I think i got them this week yes i did get them this week um they're from per una denim and that super soft sort of jean i've never had a pair of jeans this color before as you can see and then they're a 12 short and um, just so they fit me quite perfectly if i had got them in a tell long i would have to get them taken up but as you can see they have got the the brand still on them so they're basically they're brand new so i got them for five pound from St Oswald Hospital, so I'll probably wear them to come home in on the sat on the Sunday. So I was thinking these jeans to go with the Abercrombie top, which is my mum's, which is that one, and then with um, a Juicy Couture hoodie. Yeah, so basically with the Juicy Couture hoodie that I've got in the case at the minute, so it's just this one that I was thinking, just in case the weather changes, because obviously with the being British weather, you don't know what the weather's going to be doing, but it's cold one minute, then it's warm the next. So I'm just going to put that in. If it is a bit nippy on the Sunday, I could always take it out of the case and whatnot. And then just in case I decided not to do that, I'm going to take a jumper. So I've got the best top that goes underneath. Got that from Marks's outlet. And then obviously I've got this Marks and Spencer's jumper from the truck shop. Um, it is a crochet jumper and I think I paid five or six pounds for this and it's got like a little tie on the back so I'll probably take that as well just in case I didn't want to wear the top with the jeans I could also wear this with the jeans rather than wearing the top so that's going to go in there as well the shoes that I might be wearing to come home in on the Sunday I'll just wear my Converse because they are quite comfy and I've got the choice of sandals or a pair of Converse so I'm just going to put my Converse in there now just so because they, they are super super comfy as long as you wear the right sock with them I got some carry more socks at Sports Direct a few weeks ago now and oh my god best thing ever done they're just so comfy and also you can get like the cheaper versions from Primark but yeah, I've got a pair of men at the minute. I've got a pair of knickers as well. I've got my pair of knickers out that I'm going to be travelling in. Oh, and what I'll do now is I'll show you guys where I'm travelling in I for got London. these jeans a few weeks ago from the charity shop. They were too long at the time, so I had to go down to my local and get them taken up. I had these taken up about 8 inches, so they then fit me great. They're just about that much short than full length. Um just i want them to be like that so when i wear my sandals on saturday which is tomorrow they're gonna look cool so and they're in a size 14 and it's skinny from marks and spencers but i think i only paid five pounds for them at the charity shop where i work and then i got a hairband out when i was with me nana 
was originally £15, I got it for £9 and I got it from TK Maxx. It's just like where it, like it is now, but obviously curl me hair. Yeah, this is the shirt that I will be wearing with the white jeans. I got, I got this from Holster, I got it in the size large, as you can see. I paid £29 for this. It is a thin material as of linen, so I thought linen would be quite cool and refreshing since the weather down in London is going to be really warm and humid. So I thought maybe wear that and it is quite loose and it's really light as well for a shirt as well. So unfortunately I can't wear a dress to London because I had a major accident on my bike last Saturday, just gone, and unfortunately I can't not wear a dress. Um, I'll show you the reason why now. Okay, so the bruise I am going to show you is on my right leg and I'm quite good that, that I'm not able to wear a dress because I did have a dress in mind for Saturday for London. Unfortunately, I've had to change that. So basically, I'll just move my phone down just a bit so you can see. So basically, I fell off my bike and the bruising has come out. So unfortunately, I'm going to have to cover myself up this week. So yeah still so but yeah it is what it is i'm still gonna look nice i hope but yeah so that's my leg and the story of it i had a bag on my handlebar i came off my bike and rolled it in the middle of the road but i'm all right i'm safe i'm well i'm not dead you know what i mean i'm all right i'm well and i can walk on it which is good but yeah i just can't wear a dress Okay, last off, so I have got my toiletry bag just here. So basically, I am taking my number seven essential moisturiser night cream. I got this from the charity shop. I got it for £4.50. When I priced it on the Boots website, it's normally like £19.50 for the tub of 50 mils. So, taking my night cream. Then I'm taking my own Berto Gianni shampoo, which I got from TK Maxx. Um, it's normally like a tenner, but I got it for £4.99. Then I'm taking like my hair mask for like hair conditioner because I tend to leave it in when I get washed and then once I've been washed I rinse my hair and it was roughly the same price four ninety nine from from a tenner and then deodorant which Helen got us which is same as mum and then she also gave us some makeup remover as well which is this one here I can't pronounce it so Helen gave me that as well so I'll take that with us as well. And then I will be taking this um, Miracle Cleanser with me as well. It's technically, it's like a, it's like a skin routine, like a skincare product that you would use. So technically, you wash my face, put this on first, and then put my day cream on. And then on the night time, we just, after I've had a shower, and I usually use my number seven, sort of night cream, and then obviously this, and then my day cream will go on after that. So I'm going to take that, and then it just like foliates your skin. So I'm going to be taking that with us too. And then... Obviously sun cream as well, because uh, apparently it's going to be warm down in London as well. And also, I think I've got a bottle of Prosecco downstairs, which I'll put in the case for the hotel room. Just because it's my last 75th birthday, why not? And, and I think that's me all, all done. I just need toothpaste and a toothbrush in my case, and hairbrush. That'll go in my bag. Uh, but I think about that's it. I think that's it. Okay guys, as you can see, I have packed my case. Um, I've just put that on top because obviously it needs a clean, so I'll probably do that later. Um, just the few bits and bobs that need to go in it, like so for instance, like toothpaste, like my toothbrush, bottle of Prosecco needs to go in. Um, I'm not sure if I need to take my hair dryer, so I need to check if the hotel has a hair dryer. If so, I'll probably take it. Um, I'm gonna curl my hair tonight. And you probably say it's worth curling my hair tonight. But anyway, I'm all sorted, I'm all packed. My outfit's ready for tomorrow, I'm happy fabulous um, but like i say if you do like this video please comment down below and like and subscribe to my channel uh, but over and out i'll see you tomorrow for the london vlog with my nana so bye